What's up guys, we're going to be playing some Fallout 4 today. Uh, for you right now, I have Fallout 4 at Ultra settings, just the generic Ultra, nothing tweaked. And we're going to load it up. Alright guys, and we're back. Uh, we just loaded up here in Sanctuary. Now this is actually a pretty bad test because I have a pretty heavily modified Sanctuary as my main town. So we're getting some fairly low frames per second here and the rain is not helping. But overall, you see we're getting decent. It's playable, especially considering it's ultra. So let's go ahead and switch your location to somewhere not so decked out. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and go to the Mass Gravel and Sand. Alright. So this is just generic area. Uh, I don't think we're going to have any people here. As I said, I was cleared. But you're seeing we're getting pretty smooth gameplay. Pretty above 50. You can't always trust that counter. The, the, the average and max that I have in the overlay here because it doesn't, you know, includes loading screens and junk like that, so. Um, but it should go up as we keep getting some frames. Oh, what do we got? I heard them, but I just don't see them. There they are. Help defend the checkpoint, alright. So, I mean, we're getting some pretty stable frames. You see GPU uses is, is at max. Um, which is good. You know, there's been a lot of talk that AMD processors are bottlenecking uh, in Fallout 4 because of Fallout 4 insane CPU requirements, but that doesn't seem to be the case. And even during combat, it really only goes down to 40 or so. Oh, sorry, guy. Yeah, I'd say ultra settings with this setup, you're looking at a really, uh, Monica bullets. That's my guy. Yeah, I'm sorry guys, I'm really messing up. But yeah, overall, I think you can expect a pretty playable experience with the ultra settings. I do not think you're going to get 60 frames with ultra. Maybe if you bring it down a little bit, um, you can hit that 60 frames at high settings, or maybe an ultra and high mix. Uh, but overall, guys, that's going to be it for me. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. If not, let me know what you didn't like in the comments. Bye for now. I'll see you next time.